Recently, the Biden administration signed into law the uh, Inflation Reduction Act, which has many components to it. One of those which is increasing the IRS enforcement. They are planning to hire 80 some thousand agents. What does that mean for us as business owners and individuals? That that means that they are gonna increase enforcement and audits, both desk audits and in-person audits on clients. Administration says is more than, making more than $400,000 a year in, in taxable income. I believe that it could be potentially less than that, especially for small business owners. If you receive a notice from the IRS or any Department of Revenue, I recommend you contact a professional. We're, we're happy to help you or uh, the tax preparer or professional that you use to prepare your tax returns. That should be the very first thing you do. You should bring the copy of the notice to them and set up an appointment to determine what the audit is about uh, and how, to, how best to respond. You sign a power of attorney with the preparer or the CPA that you're gonna use or the attorney that you're gonna use. They will then reach out to the IRS or Department of Revenue and start to work down the document that they send you, which is called an IDR or information document request. That will outline what type of audit it is, whether it's a withholding tax audit, an income tax audit, or at the state level, a sales tax audit. There are many other types of audits, but those are the most common. And with that professional, then you'll answer the questionnaire, part of that notice, and also start to provide documentation related to the audit. I think this is gonna become a lot more common. You're gonna see a higher statistic of clients receiving notices from the IRS. Some of these will be very specific, looking at one or two deductions, and there'll be desk audits where there'll be you'll just be mailing documents back and forth to the IRS or Department of Revenue. Some of them may be full-on audits that encompass many years, and those will likely be handled in person, although with COVID restrictions uh, in recent years, many of those have also been handled through desk audits or just mailing documents back and forth to the IRS or the Department's Revenue. If you have any questions or concerns about this, please don't hesitate to contact us. Our contact information is here in the video. Uh, like and subscribe. And uh, I hope you don't win the lottery no one wants to win, which is an IRS audit or a Department of Revenue audit. But if you do, we're here to help you if you need us.